it's, uh, it's an interesting discussion recently where uh, the European government uh, was planning on uh, making, essentially making uh, planting seeds closed source. That, that they were trying to, to enforce uh, people to only use the seeds they uh, uh, clear. Um, recently, I, I've read in another book that uh, the, the, the one of the ways to actually uh, take freedom fr from people is to control their food source. Uh, I, I'm not trying to, to scare people, <laughs> but <laughs> uh, I, I'm actually kind of wondering where in, in this com community um, if, if, well, first of all, if anybody else heard of this, maybe raise hands if, if you did. So yes, I am. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, second, uh, what were they smoking? <laughs> now, really, they were smoking uncontrolled uh, wheat. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> now, it's it's it's, uh, it's 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 actually one of the, one of the things that that scares me most uh, in in recent uh, recent uh, 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 news. Um, is, is is there anybody else that that wants to feedback uh, maybe on on this uh, while we have time? There, there's a hand. Uh, do we have a second microphone? Or I, I realize I might be preaching to the choir here, but <laughs> um, I freaked out when I hear that they will norm the food in the EU, and that was driving me crazy. That they say, oh, when it has not a perfect shape or something, it's class B. Yeah, exactly. Like that's, that's one of the things. They, they actually, uh, you have these, these little Dutch gardens uh, communities, there's a uh, moestuinen, I don't know if there's uh, an English word for it, but they, they actually plan to ban those or at least restrict those to using the seeds only cleared by the government. Yeah, that's, that's the second thing I wanted to mention. They only uh, give away specific seeds. They don't get, give you the freedom to seed what you want. Also, uh, and that's that's one of the things. Uh, who's going to to decide who gets the seeds? Uh, I mean, okay, we've got these seeds; they are cleared. Um, perhaps even we're going to uh, sell them. Uh, but who's going to sell them, and at what price? It's uh, it's it really if if this was going to get through uh, the government, uh, I, I think we would have had a problem, and not only uh, in restriction. But I don't see uh, a body like the government uh, capable of uh, actually uh, doing this without causing a food sh shortage in, in, the, in the process. And the variety of food will decrease dramatically because there's only a specific food allowed. Yeah. Yeah. And oh, oh. don't forget, and this is important, if you're only going to uh, allow specific seeds, uh, cloned seeds, of, of course, uh, you're going to have uh, a lack of variation in, in genes. And this is, well, maybe, maybe a bit deep, but uh, what's, what's going to happen if, if this type of seed is going to be attacked? You, you, you no longer have variation in your food uh, sources. So uh, entire food crops uh, of the same type are going to be destroyed if you're out of luck. I have a, a question of, uh, for this. Um, are there any students or hackers on, of Wageningen University in, in, the, in the room or in the camp who have an opinion about this uh, seed business? And I'm calling for the Wageningen University because that's the University of Agriculture. No one from Wageningen? Any also any food hackers yeah. who uh, want to comply? <laughs> no, I guess not. <laughs> 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 Anyways, this was my two cents, and I hope you forgive me.